Welcome back to Power BI Helpline. Let's talk about how to show top 5 accounts, irrespective of its positive or negative balances. In this data, I have account wise total amount. And based on that, I created this bar chart, which is currently showing all the positive amounts on the top and then negative amounts at the bottom of this visual. Now the requirement is to show top 5 amount irrespective of the debit or the credit. If I want to filter for top 5, Usually I can go to the format section and from there, I can easily filter for top 5 accounts based on the total amount. Or even if would like to filter for bottom 5, I can easily do that from here. But there is no such default feature to get the top 5 account numbers based on its absolute values and irrespective of the positive or negative numbers. We will solve this problem. Earlier we have posted a video about how to show top 5 and bottom 5 in the same visual you should check out that video as well. All right, to solve this particular problem, let me first create the total amount measure, which I can easily create by adding the amount column using my aggregate function. Now I will create an another measure, which will create the ranking of all the accounts based on total amount, but here you need to apply the trick, which you will see inside this measure called account rank. To create the rank, I will use rank x function and the first argument I will pass as all selected accounts. Now in the expression argument, I will validate. If my total amount measure is less than zero, then I will multiply the total amount measure with minus one to get its absolute value, else I will use the total amount measure as it is. This way, it will calculate the ranking based on the absolute value of the total amount measure. Now, select the visual and apply a visual level filter using our rank measure. The value of this measure should be less or equal to 5. With this you will immediately see that uVisual has been filtered for the top 5 account numbers irrespective of its negative or positive values. If you want to apply a conditional formatting to show red and green for its negative and positive values, you can create this measure. Here we can assign the colors based on the total amount measure and then use it to dynamically format the bar colors. For this, select this FX and then choose field value and then select your conditional formatting measure. Click on OK, and your top five accounts with dynamically formatted colors is ready in this bar chart. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to our channel for more such interesting videos on Power BI. Post your feedbacks and suggestions in comment box.